Hi everybody, welcome back to another reading and right now we are doing the fire signs, Aries, Leo and Sagittarius. This is a November reading for the fire signs. Uh, let's see what's coming up for you guys. I've got my cards here and I'm shuffling them and uh, these are my monology card deck. I'm just going to use it to show you the cards. I'm going to keep keeping the cards here. Um... I'm going to keep putting them there. Remember, uh, guys, this is a general reading. Might or might not resonate. Uh, while I was uh, shuffling, this card fell out of my hand. So I'm going to include it in my reading. It's the victory card. Like you can see. And I think uh, if you did start anything, you did face with any challenges or you thought... I don't know why I get the word defeated, but the opposite of defeated is victory. So if you did uh, feel defeated or you think you couldn't complete something or... Uh, something uh, got interrupted in between only and you actually lost the strength to know that uh, to uh, lost the strength to take uh, the project forward i think it's going to be a victory time for you in november especially around uh, i get 15th november is a good time for you when you can uh, not just restart your projects but look at your projects again and i think you will be victorious in whatever you will start or you had started uh, at the time you were uh, listening to this reading so the first card is the victory card and I feel it much with business and I feel it much with any service related thing or a job or getting anything new. Uh, so uh, they'll, they'll be victory in it. Especially if something you did, you were just going to give up, don't give it up. And I think that's going to uh, be better in November if you thought your business was not really doing well. But I think uh, you will uh, make money out of the same business. So that's the first card and I think it's a beautiful way to begin the reading for November for the fire signs. I also feel fire signs are dealing with earth signs. That's another message that I get. And it's going to be okay if you're dealing with the earth sign and it's not being going well. Uh, like I said, victory and the second card I got was opportunities. A lot of opportunities coming your way. A lot of doors opening. Almost like a lot of ev every window opening, every door opening. And it's almost pretty much open. It's not that it's just half open. And I think a lot of opportunities are coming your way especially uh, fire signs and that's also a beautiful card so you'll be victorious in more ways than one is what i get um i, I feel you'll be not just uh, you know hearing if you've applied for a job uh, at different multiple places i think you'll be hearing back from a lot of them uh, for you to give interview i think you'll have more choices i also feel you'll have more choices uh, um, in, in, in relationship also and more choices in relationship doesn't mean uh, just you know uh, if you're seeing someone and uh, you know it's like uh, uh, dating some you know one more person or something it's also it's it's more like you know if you're going for going in for an arranged marriage I feel you'll have a lot of choices uh, you uh, you'll choose between two people is another thing that I get and uh, I, I feel more for an arranged marriage it is not uh, for love marriage if you really think you know you are looking at uh, people online um, i think there'll be multiple people who will be interested in you and there'll be a there'll, mul there'll be multiple people uh, you will be interested in and then you will take it forward from there so that's why i don't get just one person i get more than one person let's see what's your third card just be careful of any deceit that happens uh, will happen uh, in November could be in business could be in love uh, could 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 be you know somebody uh, backstabbing you one of the uh, people you're working with I don't know why I get more like uh, somebody you're working with will actually backstab if even if it not backstab uh, will say bad things about you to the seniors so just be careful and if you really have had that hint or that intuition that somebody is not you know uh, uh, really being nice to you or uh, as is already talking uh, you know about you to the seniors and uh, you, you've you been feeling that way and I think that that feeling is right so just be careful and I think you can confront the person if you have evidence or if somebody said that you know this person said bad things about you I think you can confront the person also because I, I, I feel there is deceit and I see there is deceit uh, please face your fears in November whatever you've been uh, fearing I think that was uh, when I said defeat you were fearing that you will get defeated in something but I think victory is on its way so you don't need to worry because uh, uh, because uh, Kalima is with you and uh, she is the goddess of, of of strength and and victory over evil and I think that's what's going to happen with you anything also that you thought was evil I also get uh, you know if you had an enemy maybe that deceit card was there so you uh, somebody did deceive you and uh, you didn't expect that out of them probably it was your friend who deceived you and has now become an enemy so I think it's almost like uh, you will you will defeat your your enemy 
in words or probably or you'll confront the person and you'll say you know I know what you did to me uh, that kind of a situation I get so you want to win in the end that's another uh, that's another message that I get I also get that uh, move beyond your current challenges so maybe uh, because you thought you're going to get defeated in whatever you started I think you got to look at the situation with new eyes you're going to approach it differently so please uh, if if you've not been really doing well in in a venture or you think it's not giving you much returns i want you to see it another way not just give give up on it or you know not i don't want you to close shut shop that's another message that i get please don't shut shop okay uh, right now it's not the time it's right now if you do anything it will it will it will give you profits it will give you returns that's another message that i get and I also get the message that your purchase power is going to be really high in November. You know, the things that you wanted to buy, you will buy uh, fire signs. Uh, uh, let's see what are the other messages that I get. I'm also doing channel messages side by side with the tarot. So let's see what's the other message. Call to action. Right now, it's not a time to sit and just think about the whole thing. It's time for action. If you've been delaying something, if you've been procrastinating, that's not right because no November is all about action. Especially after 25th, I feel for a lot of you, it's... it's uh, the time is going to be very busy for you. You're going to be a busy bee. Uh, you'll have to do a lot of multitasking. A lot of things will be coming your way. So uh, the other message that I get is if you want to rest before uh, the 7th or the 17th, I think I'm doing it after the 7th. So I'm going to take 17th November. If you, if, if you want to rest before 17th November, it's fine because after that you will be really busy and you'll have uh, time for nothing else. So let's see what are the other messages for you guys. Fire signs. I also get the message for you to be a brave heart in that situation to deal with the situation brave bravely you know be brave maybe that's why I got uh, I got uh, facing fear as another message or as another card that I just put out there I also got the words uh, meek and weak you can't be meek or weak right now that's not the time to be meek and weak because November will really test test your strength that's another message that I get you can't sit idle that's that's another message guys November end fire signs cannot sit idle I also get fire signs will be dealing with earth signs another message that I get let's see what are the other messages and another uh, channel message that I get is not to pretend anymore. I don't know what it means to you because this is a general reading so might or might not reson resonate but you know your situation the best and if you've been pretending in a situation not being yourself I really want to say it's time not to pretend and a time to be uh, you, you know show the world the real you that's another message that I get. Something will come to light. That's another message. Something will come to light right now. Sorry, the card is bigger, so I'm just going to put you put it right there. Also, get a lot of light after the darkness. Probably you were facing a difficult time. I get more in September and in July. July and September were, for fire signs was not really good. For a lot of signs, it wasn't good, but I get more for fire signs. The two months weren't really good. And it all started in Jan and Feb this year. So you've been having a hard time for a long time, fire signs. I think it's going to be okay because I get the light here and I also get spreading light. I also get, you're a teacher, whoever's listening to this, uh, one person might be connecting, you're a teacher. You, you teach people. There's light, there's more light. I think there is assurance from the world that you're on the right path because I see a lot of light. These two, these two cards, there is light coming in. It's like light at the end of the tunnel. It's also a new day for me. It's also challenges, you know, almost climbing over the mountain and coming, you know, um, down from the other sign, uh, side. That's another sign for me. You know, it's almost accepting the challenge and, and, and winning. I don't know, but I feel yellow is good for you in November, fire signs. And I see a lot of fire. Now that I'm talking, it's all about fire. So you need a lot of fire to do things. Probably you need a lot of energy to do things. I'm getting a lot of fire here. I'm getting that yellow and orange for you fire signs. So you, you will need a lot of energy. It will be thrilling for you. The ride is going to be thrilling for you in November. 
lot of yellow, lot of energy, lot of fire. Maybe you need that fire in your belly to achieve things. That's another message that I get. If you're going to buy a house, do it after, uh, do it post 21st. That's another message that I get. And that's November post 21st November. If it's about buying a new property or especially buying a new house, I want you to do it after 21st November. That's the date that I get. Because a lot of time when I'm doing, a lot of times when I'm doing readings, it's mostly about houses. Also, when should I buy a new house, or is the time good to buy a new house? So, fire signs. That's your that's your date from my side. I don't know why, but I also get the word mustard for you guys. It's also it's also very yellow, and that that's the kind of those are the kind of colors that I'm getting for you, especially yellow, mustard, orange. You need to have the confidence. That's exactly what I said. Whatever the challenge, challenges and everything that you've been facing before November, it's going to be okay because you need the confidence. And if you have the confidence, you're going to overcome everything. I think November, whatever you want to do is in your hands, the way, the way you're going to mold things. I think it's just fear that you've been operating from because you, you just, you've just been scared. You've got everything. You've just been scared to put it put everything together that's all and see luck is on your side november is a good month for you fire signs i told you you don't have to worry because everything will happen your way or the only thing you need is confidence and to put things right i also got a new start is coming so something new is coming for you guys i don't think your emotions are going to run too high you, it's you're not going to use your heart too much you're going to use your head too much that's what i feel Your emotions are not much at play, fire signs in November. I think it's all about work. November is more a work month for you. I feel December end is more about emotions, but November it's all all focusing, you know, focusing on work, on starting something new, building something new, restarting something old. Told you energy is gaining momentum. So things are going to be really, after 17th, I get a lot of 17th, after 17th, things are going to really move fast for you guys. And probably that's why I said you need to rest and you need all the energy, you know, to get things going in November end. I'm not, I don't have the love cards, but I'm going to channel messages. For love messages, I get, um, give yourself time in the relationship. That's the message that I get. I also get a lot of you feeling blue in the relationship, you know, just, 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 I don't know why I got the word boredom also. I also got the word be open, but the, the moment I said be open, I also got the words be bold and make the first move. So some of you need to make the first move. Probably you, uh, uh, you're not telling the other person how you feel. So if you've been contemplating, if you've been thinking about it, deliberating that should I, or should I not express my feelings, I think. November is the time to express your feelings. You need to go ahead and tell the person how you feel. I also get the color powder blue. Powder blue is good for you in November. This is for fire signs. This card I'm getting again and again. I didn't take it in the reading, but I will and it's come... Uh, reversed it says emotions are running high exactly what i said you're going to you will uh, use more of your head not your heart to make decisions that's what i get november is not a time for love for you guys you know it's almost taking a back seat i'm going to pull out one more card because i think one more card belongs in this reading i was going to close the session but i think one more card one more message for the fire signs is important for me to give What's the message? What's the message? What's the message, guys? What's the message? One more message for fire signs. Also got the words shop till you drop. So that's what fire signs are feeling. So maybe one of you is feeling that way. One more message. What's the message for fire signs? 
it says feeling grace so whatever you do do it with grace also share your gifts with grace and uh, waves of inspiration and love are coming to you so you'll be getting inspired love is coming your way uh, remember not to lose your dignity or grace in your situation that's probably the message that I want to give you guys and that's why I had to close this reading with 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 this card so uh, be graceful that's how the world views you if there is a fight if whatever if there is an exchange of heated words you need to exit the situation very gracefully you handle the situation very gracefully probably that's a message that I needed to give you yes those were the messages fire signs Thank you so much for listening to the reading. I'll be back again with another reading and uh, I hope you enjoyed your reading and I hope November is going to be a great month for you. I can see a lot of work, work, work. But yes, don't forget love and I feel money coming your way though I see it more towards November end. If you want to shift your house, do it in November end because November end is a better time than mid-November for you guys. That's what I feel because you're going to be re really busy in November. So also do rest. Because like I said, you're going to be a busy bee in, the, in November end. So those were your messages. Thank you so much for listening to me and I'll be back again. Thank you. Good night.